Hi, I'm Centra, and I will be presenting messages using Clear Vision Dual Deck, created by Andrea Fertig. Clear Vision Dual is a relationship deck. It deals with feminine energy, earth and water. These two elements make beautiful things. So I hope you join me. See you soon. Bye. These messages are for Gemini. Your first message is, mind your manifestation. Intense yet gentle, a seedling of a whisper is implanted within one's mind. And indeed, that is all it takes, a tiny seed. Deep rooted in consciousness and nurtured with desire, this tiny inclination holds a bounty of potential that cannot yet be seen, but with faith and patient action be visualized and properly nurtured into full bloom. So that idea, that thought, that thing you want to do, do it. The seed has been planted and the necessary care will unfold into your palm for you to provide. Nurture your seed should you withstand the elements of your physical, mental, and environmental space and abound with the priority and honor of the seed. A bountiful harvest awaits you. So can you do it? Of course you can. But often the hardest part is just beginning. But once you water that seed and shine your light on it, just a bit, it will take on a life of its own. So how do you bring what's out of sight into sight? With the use of the parallels of your mental and physical capabilities, you will be able to produce the manifestation you have in mind. So be patient, be attentive, be protective. Your season of the bountiful harvest shall come. Mine your manifestation. Your second message is the work of the harvest. Tis never easy. The temperature may be uncomfortable and there may still be a long way to go. But persevere, goddess, for you dare not leave with only half a harvest. Muster your strength if you must and forge on, even if hands bleeding. Do not allow weaknesses to fall upon you. Forge on until your rightful bounty is before you. Did ever blossom, not bloom? Of course not. Yet the strongest and most brilliant awaits you by the masses. All one must do is the last efforts of the work of the harvest. It's already yours. Just claim it. At this time, you may have seen some of your rightful due rewards, but know there is more to come if you continue with your efforts. Tired you may be, but in the end, you will have reaped an abundance surpassing that of your desire, an abundance worth every bit of pain you endured along the way. Work diligently and rest when necessary. This harvest was yours from the day you planted the first seed. So keep going. The time is near when you'll be more than glad you did the work of the harvest. Your third message is aligning alliances. The dance of an abundant alliance requires both faith and grace to survive and shine. Each ally here brings complementing components to the union to produce complementing results. With opposing hands, each offers protection to the other, blocking boomerangs thrown at their rears. However, should one neglect or refuse to shield the other from harm, she must be mindful that the boomerang most definitely will come back for her. And that's karma. At this time, you are in or headed towards having an abundantly aligned partnership 
in business or tangible endeavors that will lead to success for both of you. However, the rules of the alliance must always apply or you could be cut by a shady ally from behind for naivety or by raging forces of bad karma in front for abandonment. For at this moment, you should commit your good intentioned efforts to more than just you and you'll both be stronger and more wealthy in the end because of it. So do your best and do your part. Aligning Alliances. Your fourth message is parted paths. Even though you may have the fortitude to march into the night, unfortunately, they can't and must follow the sun. Watching them depart from you may be unexpected and difficult. However, know they have been planning this exit for some time now. Sometimes a choice is made concerning you, without you. Hurtful, yes, but in the end, we must always consider we are only in charge of our own paths and the people we encounter in life are doing their best as well to take charge of theirs. So, if an unexpected separation has occurred, realign your focus to the path not the past. Your sun shall indeed shine again. In regards to another, take the lesson learned from this parting and understand and appreciate the free will involved and free connection with others. In regards to a romantic relationship, painful indeed, sudden romantic separation is hard. Know that there is someone out there ready and willing to mend your heart. Loneliness does not have to be your destiny. And in regards to yourself, if you are in decision with yourself, the less traveled road will serve you well at this time. If this is not the case, it may be time to leave someone behind. It may hurt, but you will be better off for it. Part it pass. And with that, I would like to share my symbols in the bag with you. Your first symbol is Vesta. Vesta is all about the heart, fireplace, home, and family. And she is an Aquarius at this time. The number four. And Neptune. Neptune is in Pisces. I hope you enjoyed my messages. See you soon.